Hey guys, it's your boy MZA and here's Asu with me. You asked for it, Nadi or not. Asu, tell them what's up. Okay guys, so now we're here. We're gonna argue if someone is truly lifetime natural or enhanced. Now before we talk about this, you have to understand he might, we might be wrong at the end of the day. He might be truly natural. No. 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 Okay. <laughs> or he might, we might say that he is natural, but in real life, he is really enhanced and he took so many cycles. Again, this is our opinion after we know a lot of people, after we experimented a lot, after we know how the steroids affect the human body, how it has a certain appearance, if he, if he developed really fast. So without further ado, let's hop right into it. Okay guys, so you, this is heavily requested. Everyone is asking, apparently his name is Hamza. He's on Instagram and, and he's- TikTok. He's famous, on, I've seen his videos on TikTok. Yeah, he has like a short, quick videos where he gives you amazing- Tension tips. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, because you have an inside joke. Every time you look at his video, and he, he's doing a tricep extension, for example, don't do this. Do this because it has more tension. Don't do this with the rotator cuff. Don't use dumbbells. Use cables. Why? All the tension. <laughs> <laughs> now, first of all, Hamza, an amazing physique, honestly speaking. Mashallah, he's, he's very nice, very yeah, well developed. He's very well developed. Uh, 22. I, he's 22 and... Um, he says, Alhamdulillah, natural aesthetics. I mean, I don't know how you could put those two together. One's a lie, one is a blessing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now let's go and see a picture of him shirtless. I want to see, before we jump into it, there are three vitamins that I use to include them. What does it think? Magnesium, vitamin D3. That's nice. That's nice, but I wouldn't actually use it to increase my testosterone. It should be there. Like zinc, you can use it as a drug for your mood, but to be like it actually, I use it as a drug to increase my testosterone. No, you should certainly always have your zinc, magnesium, vitamin D3 on hand. We found it. Here's the clip, okay. Ooh, ooh, my man, grew. What were you doing? Were you eating the stuff? <laughs> I mean, I think I was like 15 in the first two photos. So, based on that, so that means he was more of a skinny guy, more of an ectomorph. More of an ecto, so, so we we'll find it hard to grow. So it's kind of hard for an ecto to grow. Again, there's a genetic predisposition that how much muscle you can add when you start working out. What do you look like without working out? But I have to say one thing. Can I know what is the size of his arms? Can we go and like message him right now? <laughs> He's not gonna reply. Wait, let's check his story. Oh, he has stories. Okay, leg and arms. Leg and arms. Y'all don't do both legs, do one leg. <laughs> Why? Tension. <laughs> Why do you do this? Like you keep the tension on the thumb if you're holding on the right. Left leg is working, right leg is tension. <laughs> but um, he does look pretty big, like if this is a real time video. He looks pretty big. And. Uh, but even his neck grew. Uh, that doesn't happen often. So there is a part. In this video where there's a comment saying these two exercises hit different parts of your tricep throw. Thank you for that. You're a good guy. And there's like almost a thousand likes on that. And they're still debating on it. I don't know why they're debating because the minute you change to the underhand grip, your focus goes on to the short head. And if your grip is still this head, way, yeah. then it's definitely the lateral head. So, I mean, I don't know how this and this is the same thing. So, pretty simple. More lateral, more medial. Show them your lateral, Zahar. Oh, yeah, sure. Lateral, medial is the gorgeous. Sorry. Okay. Again, this is the medial, and this is the long. But yeah, the information is kind of confusing, so people will get confused. I mean, you don't need to do it. Some people might have their lateral or long in a really good 
but they want to work on their media, so they would go with an underhand killer. But I would think it's like influencers like this guy probably, you know, drop in one or two genuine things and then the rest just fill it up with something that you just believe is true. Because if you don't actually read the biomechanics or if you don't go further into what you're actually training, then you'd never know, you'd end up like this. If you want to make muscle, don't do this too often. Masturbate. Don't have to. What? CNS? He went all the way to CNS? Also, he went all the way there. But I would disagree. A lot of power lifters are fucking huge. Yeah, one rep does oh, help you. Power lifters are massive. Bro. The one rep, the one rep thing is basically activating your. When you one. get when you get way stronger, you do get bigger. Stronger means bigger. So he said, don't do it too much. But even then, I would say it's controversial. So I would say this video. Yeah. If you can't feel your lats when you do this, do this. Okay, what are we gonna do? Well, that's because that is the function of the lat. I mean, I mean, yeah, he... He could have used the word thoracic extension, but he didn't use it because he doesn't know it's a thoracic extension. He doesn't even read. No, he, he, he might know, read. but... He's already leaning backward. I mean, but he's... I like that guy. <laughs> yeah, there's a guy who's trying real hard behind him. But then he gave This up. is a myth that most gym... Okay, this I have to see. Cardio. He is right. He is right. He's good. But yeah, you can't. A good information that was nice. If you have any lower back pain, do this exercise. The muscle you need to strengthen is your. Oh, don't, don't to oh no. no, no, no. He, he you cannot, also. No, 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 no. I'm, it's not me. I'm not a physiotherapist. We have physiotherapists on the team, but you cannot go and be like, if you have any lower back pain, do this exercise. What happens is a lot of people, when they're doing glute, they might hurt themselves doing an anterior pelvic tilt. They might do a lower back arcing and then they are actually hurting themselves. And some people have good glutes. Well, maybe their spine erectors are weak, their core is weak. You cannot go generalize it in a 30 second. This will harm more people than actually will help. But maybe your intentions were good, Hamza. Maybe they were. Are you overtraining? Oh, tell me if I am. Or are you just? Not eating enough, not sleeping enough, not getting enough protein, not injecting enough. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, wait. I don't think that was. I don't <laughs> uh, Yeah, definitely not that. <laughs> definitely not that. Never do this before. Left. What are you going to pull out? What are you going to pull out? Whoa! What? He means like don't stretch and hold a stretch like that. This will increase your strength by 30%. He's looking at one study. This is what happens when you go and search Google and you get information and you just pull it in your mouth. And I told you, he's wait, filling wait, up. Wait. He's fillers. These are fillers. I want to see the study. I want to see a reference. That's the problem. You can't. There's so many research and studies over static stretching before an exercise. And yeah, it would be better to do them after. I bet he's not even a certified coach. At no? least. Yeah, no, he's definitely not. But he is offering training programs. This is a myth the most gym girls still believe. They think they will burn more fat if they do fast cardio. Less calories and you won't have enough. Wait, what? Okay, the first point was right. You Second didn't... part, I... Why? Why did you have to do that? Why do you have to make a game? Man? You will do less because... Wait, wait, you said? You'll actually burn less calories as you won't have enough energy. But what do you mean? You're, it's the same cardio. Wait, wait, no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean? <laughs> he basically burns there's no food in the stomach, yeah? No, he... Yeah, no calories. So no, he was like, you actually burn less calories... And, and you, you won't have, have enough energy. Because you won't have enough energy. Because you won't have... Oh. Wait, let me read it well. Very important. Faster cardio. You'll actually burn less as you won't have enough energy. But what do you mean? You're doing a treadmill, for example. So you are going to do the same amount of energy expenditure. So let's assume I told Zahar to do fasted cardio or I told him to do cardio after a meal. In both cases, I told him to run on a speed of five. So he's doing the same thing. I don't know if you mean like fasted, he's gonna hold the machine so it's less calories. And if he's not fasted, he's gonna use his hand. But 
Hamza, come on, bro. So overall, why we're we going through his feet is because we want to just gain ground of is this guy actually certain of what he's doing? Like, okay, if he's not certain about the fact that he's natural, or at least we're not certain about it, we need to trust him enough by going through his posts and seeing if his information that he puts out there just clearly half bullshit, half right. So I think all in all, also, what would you your big conclusion be to this one? Honestly, in my opinion, I don't think you're not sure at all. <laughs> in my opinion, I didn't even have to think about it too much. Honestly speaking, <laughs> I, if you were looking you're not natural. Legal. <laughs> if you're natural and you're looking like this, then you have to be one out of a billion. I wouldn't say one out And of even the one out of billion, I mean like, um, we have Sibam out there. He's the one in out of millions. No, he's millions. better than Sibam. This guy, if he's on steroids, if he jumped onto steroids, he's going to be better than Sibam. This is his physique, Nati. So that means... If yeah, but you if, you're, if you're theory, natty, then if you're actually natty, and that's only the only thing that you know, rest of us don't believe you, but you. So if you actually hopped on, damn, you'd look amazing. You you would break charts. <laughs> you are gonna be all okay. because you're bigger bigger than Phil Heath when he was natty. Yeah, way bigger. No, bro, this is. This is, this Come is on, good. I mean, uh, usually I look at pictures and I'd be like, maybe it's the anger, maybe it doesn't look that big, but bro, you are that big. You're really big and you are small, so I don't know what we are you eating. But you are working hard, it shows, and... Um, no one is underestimating the amount of no, work you're it's not easy, no matter what you're doing. Um, just remember, even when we're talking about these people on these episodes, just remember the reason we're talking about them is because they put in a certain amount of work, and it's not easy to look this way, but... Don't claim things that aren't true. Next up, we're back and we have our next target. <laughs> a famous influencer, a lot of you guys requested, but I don't know how to pronounce the name. Zahar? Saket Gokale. Yes, he is Indian and he's hardworking. He's really well established. That's really nice. But there's a slight question. The good thing is that he didn't mention that he is natural. No. Wild. Until a certain point, there was a natty in his bio. I remember very well, which is why I even agreed to go on. You got him? I got him. I remember so well, he changed his bio. So it was like 20, like he mentioned his age, and he was like natural aesthetics. So I think he's, even he claims vegetarian or something. I, I don't get it. Like, uh, is it really important to be natural and vegan? I don't think so, but maybe he's doing it for What happened to our meat-eating natural bodybuilders? <laughs> <laughs> Are they not putting on enough muscle? <laughs> but maybe he's doing it for religious purpose? Maybe he's Hindu? Yeah, maybe he is. So that's one thing that we keep in consideration. But I'm talking about the rest of the world. Yeah, you now, would, you would. I would say now these days a lot of people are trending. They go becoming vegetarian for a year just to get the views and to get the attention. They really don't care about animal cruelty. They're not doing it for any health purposes. They just want to do it. I don't believe they're even truly not vegetarians. But that's just my opinion. So, the moment of truth. As we're scrolling down through his page, going down through his history, because obviously, we can't just determine with one look, because that would be unfair to him and us both. We want to see how he developed. We want to see the journey. How much more muscle mass he added in a certain period of time? Yeah, so a lot of factors. How was he looking were. before? Okay, we have a nice picture here. So this was in 2018. January. So that's like three years and a half. He didn't get any bigger. That's one sign. I mean, this is his physique. How old is he? Uh, 20. He's 20, so this was like 17. Wait, we have even... Which one, who is, which one is it? Uh, I think it's this guy. Skinny lad, very skinny. Ecto. It's funny how all the Ectos Is start. Is this Dubai? Now. It's probably Dubai. 2017. So this is almost like four years ago. Exactly four years ago. Four years ago we have a picture. So now let's compare his current physique with the four years ago. So four, four years, years is ago. Good as, so let's go one by one. As you guys can see here. Let's talk and I've been working more. 11 month transformation. So this is 11 months, which pretty decent. Swipe? No, no, there's a swipe, there's a swipe in that. What do you mean swipe? 
Yeah. Day one. Hmm. Pretty naughty. Pretty naughty. So far, so naughty. But. Okay, not bad. His legs were pretty fine, yeah, it's not, nothing impressive. Nothing impressive about his physique. Mirror picture, you cannot decide. Angle, you cannot decide. But as you start going through his feed, you'll start noticing all his pictures are edited, which is, which I don't get. Let's see his form, wait, wait. Let's see his form. Crappy form. Back is fully rounded. Not Back nice. is fully rounded. But this was in 2019. Oh, not pretty. So how much is he pulling at that age? He was eating 4.5 calorie every day. Can make anything possible. And he put pizza. He put pizza. He's definitely on pizza again. So he... I have a question for God. Why? <laughs> क्रिएटिन के ऊपर दुनिया ने बहुत सारा रिसर्च किया है तभी भी लोग क्रिएटिन लेने से डरते हैं और उसकी वजह है क्रिएटिन के साइंस की ज्यादा जानकारी नहीं होना क्रिएटिन हमारी बॉडी में काम कैसे करता है कौन से टाइप का नो नो द रियल फैक्ट्स अबाउट क्रिएटिन हम्म पूरी मच एवरीवन like you wouldn't expect a natty to like all of a sudden show like a ripped structure like striations and veins but it's just in I my was, opinion i would say oh he must be on steroids yuck you look so bad bro lean or oh, he must be on steroids just wanted to tell you that you need to be patient stop expecting to see result overnight or in i said month. the same thing <laughs> this, <laughs> this is bullshit i'm out of here instead of asking <laughs> Instead of asking how can I lose weight fast, ask yourself how can I make my current diet sustainable in the long run? Well said, suck it. Nice. Everything takes time. The second picture was taken on the 13th of December, exactly seven months ago. I mean, yeah, look at him. And you're looking at striation, but I don't see any striation. I, mean, like I don't see any striation with all respect, Zahar. His biceps are small, chest is well developed, his, his he vascularity, been. look at him, the guy is about to die and that's the maximum vascularity he reached and he probably did a drop set to get a pump and maybe he took some Himalayan salt. I mean, uh, and regarding the body fat, there's a light coming this way, there's a shadow I don't see him. This is not even nine percent body fat. This is you know, ten. I think I'm just finding excuses here to point out what I really feel about him. But uh, what you're starting to say makes sense. I mean, look at him. Where is that crazy conditioning? Hmm. I don't see the crispiness. Okay, let's just go a little further. And still, still, soft, still looks soft. soft. Still soft, but still, still looks soft. I mean, like he's very go on, lean. Go he's, on. He's very go on. Lean. Let's see. This is in uh, January 15, that's... Okay, so when was this picture taken? We're getting sleepy. <laughs> now it doesn't interest Zahar because he was like, yeah, he does look fine. I mean, the when you open his profile, his edit, the pictures, the way he presents himself, the lights make a huge difference. But if you look really close to the picture... What about this picture also? Come on. Look at his back, it looks good and that's... I, I mean, it looks. With that? I mean, great physique, but there is if nothing that is wow. Physique, which I, I mean, there is a lot of editing. There's a, there's lot, a lot of, of light. There's backlights and all of that. Dog. Yeah, and I want to zoom in. Actually, as much as I'm, bro. Sorry, see what else is I mean, come say. on. Your back is bigger two, three times than this. You were looking like this when you were. Yeah, when I was. When you didn't even jump on steroids. No, I was naughty. Yeah. So when I was naughty, I had a pretty decent back structure, but I. And just, he is pretty lean, guys. Don't underestimate when you're lean how, how good you look. And I know I was just convinced about the part that he's lean. He's got muscle, and it's good muscle. It's not too much. If it was too much, then we have an answer. Yeah. But uh, it's decent and he's got a few, you know, pictures showing situation in some way, at least when I looked at it. But the way Asu puts it through, I've, I'm starting to believe this guy is actually natural. 
But I want to I wanna say one thing, sorry to interrupt Zahar. There are people that you see them on social media, they look insane. And when I come and say hi to them, I'll be like, he looks way worse. He doesn't look 20, 30% the way he people. looks. Zahar, on the opposite. Zahar, he doesn't mind you. He, he would give you the his physique, just take a picture, good life, he's done. When you see him in real life, you'll be like, bro, you look way bigger than That's sure. your pictures. But there are people, when you look at them, I'll be like, is he on his PCT? Is he <laughs> actually working out? But the truth is that his pictures are so edited, retouched, angles, is, angles and yeah. So my opinion on Sakit, what? Go Kale. What? Go Kale. Go Kale. Yeah. Sakit Go Kale, I would say you are pretty naughty. So Asa says pretty naughty and I don't know if I should stick to my decision, but you know, I've always, I've always learned and understood what Asa said. So pretty naughty from my side too. I would say, now there might be a chance that this guy is jumping on juice and he's not seeing that results. I'm not, I'm not, don't take my There are a lot of people there like are that. A lot of people who are on juice, they look natty. But the, what we're trying to tell you is that this physique is attainable naturally. You don't need to jump on steroids. You don't need to take growth hormone. You don't need to take insulin. If you want to reach this physique, hard work, dedication, commitment, good sleep, dieting. Diet. Perfect. We'll get you there. So, Sakit Gokali. You're very fired. <laughs> you are very fired, Nat. So, guys, that was it regarding Nati or not, Zahar. Well, uh, we took in two such individuals that we found really interesting. And we would like to take in two more individuals, which I would like to ask you to leave a comment and let us know who you'd like us to judge. The most common person who's going to be repeated will be picked. Definitely. That's what's up for this video. Thank you so much for staying tuned. Don't forget to leave a comment, like, share, and obviously subscribe. Most importantly, subscribe. Thank you so much for your time. Have a good one and see you later.